Hi there. Welcome to MCSI. My name is Emma. In this video, I will demonstrate how you can extract metadata from an image and use it for open source intelligence. We have another video on our channel where we introduce how open source images benefit an OSINT investigation. The description box contains the link to it. During an OSINT investigation, you will come across many images relevant to your target. The images could have been found on social media platforms, blogs, online communities, or other websites. Images are typically stored in the JPEG or PNG formats, amongst others. Following the image name, you would find the JPG or PNG extension. An image sometimes has more information than what meets the eye. Every time an image has been captured, some additional data is stored along with the image. This is referred to as the image's metadata or EXIF data. Let me demonstrate. Here is an image. It appears to have been taken near a water body. Now, let's use this tool to extract the metadata from the image. We can see that the image had been captured in November 2022. The time shown here is in UTC. If you are working across time zones, you may have to perform time zone conversions. The image was captured on an iPhone. Here, you can find the GPS coordinates at which the image was captured. It appears that the location is on a water body. It is possible that the target was on a boat at the time the picture was taken. Following this, you can see a lot of details about the camera that was used to capture this image. Within the detailed metadata, you can see that the tool has identified the platform used to capture this image as Apple Computer Inc. Being able to identify the time at which the image was taken, the device used to capture the image, and the location at which the capture was made, are extremely critical pieces of information during an OSINT investigation. Consider this scenario, an employee has taken a week off from work, citing health reasons. However, the employee seemed to be posting regular updates on their Flickr account. The employer performed some quick open source intelligence on the employee's Flickr account. Using image metadata, it was identified that the employee was on a holiday. Now, I will tell you about some caveats. Most social media platforms and instant messaging applications remove sections of EXIF data containing sensitive information, like the image capture time and capture location. In some mobile devices, if the user had not enabled the setting to store location data after an image has been captured, then the EXIF data would not contain GPS coordinates. It is also possible to remove EXIF data from images manually, before uploading them online. There are tools that enable you to modify the EXIF data on images. If you are working with screenshots, you will not be able to extract any EXIF data from it. These are some important factors to keep in mind while investigating image metadata. Now, let's take a look at the metadata for this image that was downloaded from a target's Facebook account. We do not see any critical information like the image capture date or capture location. However, we can see that the platform used to capture this image is Apple Computer. It is possible that the target uses an iPhone, or an acquaintance known to the target owns one. This piece of information is critical if the OSINT professional is concerned about the type of mobile device used by the target. You can see a timestamp value here, referred to as profile date time. This value has to do with internal camera settings. It does not indicate when the image has been captured. Here is another image where the EXIF data has been stripped. We can observe that the platform on which this image was captured is a Microsoft Corporation device. 
it is possible that the image was captured on a Windows tablet or mobile phone. We can say that when EXIF data has been stripped from an image, it is only possible to hypothesize the type of device on which the image was captured. There are numerous tools available that can extract metadata from images. You can practice using at least two to three tools so you can validate the results displayed by one tool by also using another. During an OSINT investigation, if you are looking for images relevant to your target, be sure to perform searches for publicly accessible Google Drive shares and FTP websites that contain images. It is possible to find images containing EXIF data in such sources. I hope you have a good idea now about how metadata can be extracted from images and how they can be used to build intelligence about a target. Here's a project idea for you. Download some open source images from social media platforms and blogs. Capture some photographs on your mobile phone with the location information. Gather some images from your acquaintances. Use multiple tools to extract image metadata. Examine how the metadata helps you uncover information about the target. I am sure you will have fun with this activity. If you liked this video, please hit like and share this video on social media. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel to receive more videos like this one. Join our online community of students learning useful cybersecurity skills if you haven't already. To register for a free account right away, go to our website. Happy learning and see you soon!